What's up everybody, Ebert42 here, back with some more Madden 15 Mutt action. As always, handing out the tips on how to make the coins without spending those hard-earned dollars. What up, B. Ryan? Yeah, Miller is worth some coins. I, I'm fond of the eye form and strong eye, so I feel like having a good fullback in for those. We're gonna finish up the 99 Pat Pete set here for ya. Also the Combine Warrior, or 99 Pat Pete and Combine Warrior post sets. Uh, we'll be trying those players out in some head-to-head -head action. We can get 10 viewers on here live tonight. I'll be doing a elite cornerback giveaway for you guys as well on the Xbox One. If you're watching me on YouTube, uh, make sure you go check out the Sunday Night Mutt Volume 5 video I'm doing a 10k giveaway for my YouTube sus subscribers all you have to do is go like that video make a comment that says 10k giveaway and make sure you subscribe to my channel and I'll be doing a drawing for that next Sunday thanks for stopping by B Ryan appreciate having the viewers so did some tips with you guys in the past about completing sets for profit. We were able to put together this 99 Pat Pete set for the badges. We got at 50k, so that was 150. We paid 200k for the Pat or for the 91 Richard Sherman, so that was 350. I want to say we spent between 150 and 200k on the rest of the players, being really patient, taking a week to go through and snipe all these guys. I believe this Pat Pete is still selling for 700k plus the 25k you get for completing the set. Uh, it's going to put you around 650, 660 after the 10% losses for selling them. So even if you guys don't want the 99 Pat Pete on your team for some reason. If you're sitting on some extra coins and you want to look at doing a set to flip those for more coins, I would suggest this one. I don't know how much longer it will stay profitable. But most of these RTTP cornerbacks and standard cornerbacks, I was able to get between 250 and 1,000 coins in auctions. Not through the buy it nows, but just bidding on them uh, before I go to bed, in the morning, you know, whatever, letting those auctions run, getting lucky, picking, picking up these guys for cheap. Some of these guys, like Pat Pete, Daryl Revis, uh, I ended up getting pretty much all the rest of them for half price through bidding. So if you go check out this set on the Mutt Head, I spent about half on all the expensive guys and less than half on the cheap guys. What up, Johnny? Yeah, we'll be doing, uh, if we can get 10 viewers in here tonight, I'll, uh, I'll go pick up an elite cornerback and do a giveaway on the Xbox One for you guys tonight. Again, uh, I do shows every Thursday from 7 to 9 and Sunday from 9 to 11. We're looking at adding in Tuesdays from 7 to 9 as well. Actually might do like 6 to 8 on Tuesdays or 5 to 7 even. Haven't figured it out. But once we can get 25 viewers in one of those shows, I'll be giving away the 90 Leon Hall Final Edition cornerback. So we've been doing pretty good on the auction house the last couple weeks. Appreciate all you guys stopping by, checking me out. Want to give back to uh, all the viewers on YouTube and Twitch to say thank you. Appreciate your guys' support. We've been streaming for about two months now. Oh, this is going to be awesome. Bam. 5k ba -ba -da -ba -ba -da -ba. Patrick Peterson 
Yeah, I'm pretty pumped about that, man. Uh, so we did the fullback set for pretty cheap, and now we've done this Pat Pete set. Again, uh, check out my YouTube series on coin making for all my tips on how to rake in those coins. So you can improve your teams without spending all the money on those packs. Sniped most of these pieces for Poe for pretty cheap as well. So now we, we got most of these for under 10k. Poe for like 1k. The badges were all under 5k. Um, so again, the badges, let's say we spent 5k on those, that's 20k. Another 10k on all these is 70k. We can have about 71k spent and he's selling for 90k right now. So if you're able to go pick these up for cheap, pick up a couple badges for around 5k. This is another set. I think the window is going to be pretty short on. Uh, but you can complete that. We're going to probably shove him in the lineup tonight, but I will probably sell him as soon as I get offline. So we're pretty excited to get the hero for the Combine Warrior sets. Not sure what he's going to be. Apparently there's a Bears logo on all those. People are saying Hester or Erlacher. Uh, they do have rights to Hester. I could see that. I was hoping for a Dion. Head over to the defense. Just going to go ahead and add Poe in the bottom. Not sure if I want to replace the Will Fork or the... Williams with him. So this is that Leon Hall we're looking at giving away for you guys. Doesn't look that great compared to Pet Pete. So for the guys I got chilling in the stream, how you guys doing tonight? You having a good night? What are you guys doing up so late? Appreciate having you, don't. Don't interpret that the wrong way. Peppy. The only thing we're giving up is play rack. This Wilfork just plays so well. We're going to put him in the D-Tackle 1 spot for tonight. And then... I think we're going to leave Will Firkin at D-Tackle 2. Ah. looks better than Kevin Williams all around. So. In the nickel spot. Uh, so we're, we're planning on selling this Champ Bailey and the Vontae Davis and the Patrick Peterson and picking up the 97 D Hall. Uh, moving the Sherman into the slot and trying D Hall out on the outside. Uh, we can always switch Sherman back to the outside they're trying to face catch on us or anything like that. Champ, we're giving up strength. We actually gain tackling. We gain block shedding. Lose a little bit of blitzing capabilities. Fine with that. What up, lick my cats? 
how's your night going, ma'am? Thanks for stopping by. Clever name play there. Got the lineup set for you guys. Hop into our next game. Had a rough stream on Sunday. Played a couple close games. Didn't quite get there. Let's see how this Pat Pete performs for us tonight. So we can do a little bit better for you. Again, if we can get 10 guys rocking out tonight, 10 viewers in the stream, I will go pick up an elite cornerback, do a giveaway for you guys. If you're watching on YouTube, make sure you go check out Sunday Night Mutt Volume 5. Follow the directions there to get entered in my 10K YouTube giveaway. Colts, Browns coming up on EA Sports. A perfect 70 degree day as we get set for today's matchup. I don't know which team has the better tight end, but I do Home know game with the kick. That could very well be the difference in this game today. Well, if you made me choose between the two, I'll tell you what. I'll just say you take one. I don't care who you take. I'll take the other one because they're both that good. They can do it all. As I say, you hear me say it every once in a while. They're all in one. That means they can go over top on me there. Ain't going to let that happen. Did prevent the hit stick, though. Got a Randall Cunningham guy. for you. Hopefully that'll help you out here. And 99 Pat Pete getting me the win nice and easy there. Not sure if he just checked out the lineup and bailed or what. But hey man, we'll take it. We'll take it. First game with Pat Pete. Got a win out for the playoff berth here. Can you hear me better now? Talking kind of quiet to fiance sleeping. Yeah, I know it's like 312 here, man. You waking up early or you up late? Lions it's a little delay in my stream, so sorry if my responses aren't immediate. Well, let's see if we can get a little further than the opening kickoff this game. You know, these tight ends, they can do it all. They're tremendous blockers for the running game. They got the speed to go down the field, and they got feet, Jim. You know, those quick feet, so even when they run those short routes, if there's man-to-man -man coverage, they're quick enough and shifty enough to still get away from the defender. Gotta do a wildcat. They come to the line of scrimmage. First down. The Lions are at the line of scrimmage, trying to catch him off guard with the wildcat. To the outside. Nice tackle. Sherman in on the stop there. And the crowd volume. We'll be I can barely hear the crowd volume. 
That last running play was good for only a yard, so it's second down and nine. The Lions line up in the pistol. Oh. Catch and the receiver oh. The Not good. The 50, the 40, the Not 30, good. Nice play by my opponent. All alone. Touchdown. Even on short passes. Got a little janky. Is a big, big deal. Was looking for that tight end out route right there. Stride. Look what happens. They catch it in stride. They don't slow down, of course, and good things happen. Nice touchdown run. Oh. Did well on the first play, not quite so well on the second play. Looks like a cover three shot. Lynch is in the backfield. Throws the pass. Got the completion. Gains 19. The offense is set at the line for the first down after that completion. The Browns at the line of scrimmage with their set of receivers. I have no clue if I'm playing somebody. That catch will extend the drive. I think when I was playing, anytime we crossed the 50 yard line, it was kind of like a big sigh of relief. Because I knew now that there were a lot of things that could take place. I could afford to take sacks. I could uh, afford to be a little more aggressive. Let's see how the offense reacts to this. The Browns take it from the 43. Reaches out and snatches it. And Revis in on the tackle. Second down coming up. The Browns lined up. Bunch formation. Let's go. Complete to Jeffrey. Gains 17. First down here after the completion. Quarters formation here for the defense. Oh. No, get it. Fuck me. God damn it. Peterson that time on the tackle. Great job by the Oh, that sucks. Recovering the fumble. You said the appropriate word there, forcing. The hit was so solid and so good. The offensive player had no, he had no choice. He had to give up the football. The Lions line up in the pistol offense. First down at the 15. Looking across the middle, and this pass goes incomplete as he was looking short that time. Show me a little offensive starters and a good look at the secondary, a group that could be the difference in this game today. Second down and ten. Oh, Pete, direction. you gotta come down with that. That's why I got you, boy. That's why I got you. That's why they're playing defense because they can't catch. Hey, the coaches don't care about that. When you get an opportunity, they want you to make the catch. The Lions will go with the pistol on this play. Halfway through this first quarter now. Oh, man. All right. And this is going to bring up fourth down. Short series this time for the offense. They call on Brett Kerr to punt the football. Unfortunate fumble there on our first drive. On our rollout. to make a difference in on the stop first down here Let's see what he's gonna give us on this one just take this. Formation here for the defense. Here's the handoff. This guy got off the block. Nice there. Perry, it sets up second down and eight. Plenty of defensive backs out on the field for this one. Quarters formation here for the defense. He'll throw it over the middle. They'll mark him at the 29. 
They're back at the line after that catch for a first down. Plenty of defensive backs out on the field for this one. Yeah, I'm rocking the 95 overall team. No money spent, dude. Haven't dropped a dime on the game yet. That's how we do that. 78 overall. We all got to start somewhere, man. Uh, there's a lot of good players in the 85 area for really cheap. Uh, have you done the... You played the gauntlet yet? Teach this guy a lesson. But the referees say it's on the defense. Play action there, roll out. I'm sorry, dude. I'm talking real quiet. Like I said, it's late. Just wanted to hop on, finish up this set that I've been working on. Maybe if I move the microphone, you'll be able to hear me a little bit better. Get him. Get him. Good for only a yard. Hey, this defense, they are tough. When you run that football, they got Move my mic. Can you, you hear me a little better now? Probably am mumbling, to be honest with you. The Lions in the pistol. He's got the catch. The tackle's back. All right, so he likes that play. Definitely likes that play. Such a quality receiver. You kind of mix up the coverage. You play straight man to man, you're going to give up a lot of completions. The offense is set at the line for the first down after that completion. The Lions pistol set here. Gets the oh. He is tackled at the 40 yard line. That was a power running play that time by the offense. It picked up some good yards. Nothing like it. Step it up on D here. And slug it out and get some tough running yards. The Lions will approach this play from out of the pistol. Second down and five. Looking to go down the field here. And Sherman nearly had the pick. Sherman nearly had the pick. Start the second quarter. He's running a little Seattle on me there. Third and five following the incompletion. The Lions in the pistol formation. And the second quarter is underway with this snap. And he's going to be tackled, and that's going to bring us to fourth down. You can't be faint of heart. In other words, don't run away. Ooh, is he going to go for it on the 40? Throw it down the field and take the hit. Good job. Fourth and four. On four. The coach is going to go for it. The Lions come out in the pistol. The Lions will take the snap from the 40. Breaks out of the tackle. That's an Oink. Ooh. Running room. Oh, almost got there. Almost got there. Hocked that route the whole way. Give me that ball. Give, give me that ball. They face first down. Marshawn Lynch is in the backfield. 
They'll run it here. And that picks up three. The Lions defensive coordinator, he's going to be happy with the results there. He was guessing run inside the red zone. That's what he's got. And they were ready for it. And they gave up very little yardage. Second down here. See what we get here. Nope. Threw it anyway. I gotta read that better. Oh, oh man coverage. And I just made the quick throw. I needed to throw to A there. Not reading these plays very well at 3.30 in the morning. Not an excuse. Could play better. First down coming up. Split backfield here. Here's the handoff. And gains about one. Good coaching on the defensive side. Everybody stays at home. They stay in their gap, and they hold that run to a short game. Second down after going to the ground game, the first play. Nickel formation here for the defense. Snap it out of the gun. Finds his mark. Well, they talk about it's third down lead. You got to pick up third downs to, to have success and win football games. Good play call, good pass, good catch. Now it's third. We do get the ball back at half, which is nice. They connect on that pass play, but it's still third down. Defense filling up the box here with a 4 6 formation. And he's taken down, but not until he picks up the first. The NFL is about situations. A good job by the runner, knowing where the first down was, gets it there, and he moves those chains. Big set here for the defense, lining up in the 4-6. Halftime, two minutes away. They're able to move the chains after that last run. Defense with plenty of bodies in the box here on this play. They'll run it. Here's the handoff. He's churning ahead. And Did a pass commit there. The yard line. So oh, glad we held that to four. Yeah, it's not a first down, but it sends a message. It shows everybody that you can run it when you want to. And also, it opens up so many other things for your offense. Defense comes out in a 4-6 formation. Second down and six. Keeps it here. Take a time out. Try to get the ball back here. Offensive line can block when you're outnumbered. It's up to the quarterback to get rid of the football. He does it, and he takes the sack. It's third and twelve here after the sack. The Lions come to the line with an empty backfield. the Lions from the 27. Stiff arms to stay on his feet. Incompletion on that hurried throw. Defensive coordinator. Oh, can't believe we didn't get the sack there. They can do just about anything and it's going to work and they stopped the offense that time. And so now they'll call on Kern to punt the football. Give us a little over a minute with two timeouts. Hopefully be able to put up some points here before half. time he only gets a couple yards and if I'd have been the punt returner that time I would have called for a fair catch defense was close all around you there was nowhere to go the Browns are getting set for their next possession loading up with extra defensive backs in the dime first down at the 31 oh my god interception an open lane, unstoppable. Taking it all the way mm. for the touchdown. Thought I had him. You gotta love that from your defense. They they made a nice jump on that ball. Not only do you do that, they return it a long way 
for the touchdown. Well, now we got to score before half here. Lions set to kick it. Oh, not playing well right now. Right away. That's for Very sure. <laughs> First down here. They've come out in the dime package. Set up screen. Gets it out for the completion. Oh, freaking suction right tackle. 24. That leads us to second down. No huddle time. Dropping back now into the shotgun. Finds Walker. Peterson that time on the tackle. The Browns. One timeout remaining. First down here after Looks the like he's running some ice D on me here. Here's the first snap after the big play. From the shotgun. Throws the pass underneath but can't find the mark that time as the pass goes incomplete. Second down after the incompletion. Lynch is in the backfield. Well, Getting away from the pressure. Reggie Wayne. Oh, come on, Wayne. Get out of bounds. Get out of bounds. First down. Offense ready for the snap. They hurry to the line of scrimmage. From the shotgun. Out to the left. The Browns now move Oh, the that time I could have turned up. <laughs> On the 18. Well, they didn't that time. The receiver made a nice little move, gets open, and a good throw by the quarterback. Give this a whirl. Give this a whirl. It's first down as they head to the line. It's a dime look for the defense on this play. Back to the air here on first down. Touchdown. What up to the viewers? Thanks for stopping by. Oh, I need to go for two here. I want to let me back up. Like when I'm hitting B right now, nothing's happening. Do 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 do. Ba ba da da da. We are fighting to get through this one with the W. Do get the ball back here after halftime. There we go. Yeah, I'll show you guys the lineup after the game's done for sure. Nice and easy. Tie it up. Maybe left a little bit too much time on the clock for him. So, hey, well, it's not good enough just to get a touchdown. They want to get that extra point or two points. Nice job that time. And they stop him from running it out 
to the 20. Mark him down at the 19. Who do you have for your cornerbacks? Look, my cats. The Lions get ready to start their drive. Corners formation here for the defense. First and ten. He brings it in here, and he's got the first. The Lions does have three timeouts. So they have to watch out for that. They're back at the line after that catch for a first down. Plenty of defensive backs out on the field for this one. Scrambling out of the pocket. That's a gain of six. That timeout by the We'll offense. take that. We'll take that. Wildcat, rut row. They're gonna try to catch the defense off guard as they line up in the wildcat. He's going to the left. That'll put them in what we call plus territory. That's gonna be a timeout charge to the offense. New set of downs now after picking up the first on the ground. Quarters formation here for the defense. This is not four birds. Are you fucking kidding me? Seriously? Man. That does it for the first half. Browns trail. Apparently, you just need to throw to the out. Thank you for that what? From the How does that happen? We're going to transition now. We're about to get the third quarter underway. Three deep safeties. And a touchback here. We'll bring the ball out to the 20. Seriously. They come to the line of scrimmage. First down. Marshawn Lynch is in the backfield. And here we go. The first snap of the second half. Throws to oh, no. And hit X there. Should hit me earlier. Pass that time against cover two. The two deep safeties. And you really want to throw the football down the middle or deep down the sidelines. That time the quarterback didn't do that. And that's why it was incomplete. Yeah, feeling a little dejected after that. We'll just have to shake it off. Come out, come out strong here on O. Start out the second half. It's like, man. Touchdown! Yeah, yeah, we'll get that back. Again, my opponent got some... Uh, Hail Mary, two seconds left before halftime. Oh, we'll tie it up. Come back out here on D. Need that 99 Pat Pete, the new guy, to make some plays. Maybe uh, get that pull in on some sacks. The fair catch. Fair oh, I was hoping I would give it to him on the one. Getting greedy, I know, but. The Lions offense heads on to the field. Defense filling up the box here with a 4 6 formation. Mm. Takes it from the strong eye. Good job by the defense. They mm. stopped the offense at time on first up. down. Now the defense is in a good situation. After running it, it's second down. Big set here for the defense, lining up in the 4-6. They're setting up screen. Screen. He's going to be tackled right around nice screen by my opponent. 
Well, that's a nice throw and catch by the quarterback and receiver. Puts him in good position. You did that a little better, didn't though? They still face third and six, even after that last successful pass play. Defense with plenty of bodies in the box here on this play. Setting up screen. Oh, get it, get it, get it. Get him, get him, get him. Brought to the ground. Nice job that time by the offense. Even though they fumbled, at least they were quick enough and smart enough to get it on it right away. All set to punt here. Try the punt block here. I've never seen this work, but now would be a great time. Get in there. Fair catch signal made. What up to all the viewers? Thanks for stopping by at this late hour in the evening, morning, whatever it is where you are. Eber42 here rocking the 95 overall team, no money spent. Handing out the tips on how to make the coins. Just gonna stick around. If we can get a couple more viewers in here. We'll be doing a giveaway on an elite cornerback for you guys tonight. Oh, you got to hold that block. I got to run inside that guy is what I got to do. I should have busted that. Mm. Should have busted that. Trying to showcase this new 99 Pat P for you guys. Hasn't done much for me yet. We did have a nice defensive stand on that last series. Lynch. Lynch, get there for me. Get there. One yard shy of the first down. They're in the hurry up mode. Offense lines up here. Third down and one. Looking to the right side and throwing. Oh. Should have stutter stepped there. Should have stutter stepped there. See all you viewers there, what you guys doing up at this hour? We got some night workers in here. After the long game, let's see what they do here. Let's see how they back up the big play here. Oh, dude. Antonio, you gotta block that guy. He's right in front of your face. He's right in front of your freaking face. You gotta block him. Take a chance and throw the football in the end zone to get a score. It's gonna be second down with about a minute and a half to go in quarter number three. The Lions go with the dime formation here on defense. Second and two. Screen. He has the grab. Oh, oh, I should have had that. Should have had that. The offense is so close right here. They just need to show a little power and punch this in the end zone and get that touchdown. First down here after the completion. Loading up with extra defensive backs in the dime. They come out in the dime package. Here's the handoff. And he's in. Wide open. Can grandma could have ran through that hole. It's arrogant. They just say, you can't stop us. And they lined up and just shoved it down the defense's throat. Nice run there on first and goal for the touchdown. Like to see a Pat Pete pick on this drive. Be a nice way to put a good hold on this game. He had nowhere to go, and they deck him at the 16 yard line. The 
Lions are set now for their next possession. Defense comes out in a 4-6 formation. First down at the 16. Hand off next to run on first down. Coming up, second down. The Browns out now in a 4-6 formation. The give, trying to fight through the middle of the field. That's a gain of eight. What that run does, it just puts the offense in a good situation. So a good, positive run. Got a clock runner here. It's a two tight end formation. The Lions will come to the line trying to put together a scoring drive here in the fourth. That last play was a run. Third down coming up. The Browns load up the box, going with the 46 defense. Final quarter underway now with this snap. Get in there. This is what See what he wants to do here on the 24 on fourth and two. Like this one on third down. Can you hold up and protect your quarterback to give him time to make those throws? Well, the answer to this one right now is no. Looks like he will be going for it. Not far from a first down, they're gonna go for it. The Lions come out in the pistol. Let's go. Right to the end. Quarterback did not get the snap in time. That'll be a delay of game. Hey, you throw the pass on we'll the take that. Catch the defense off guard, and it did not work. The defense is ready. Good job by the defensive player. The offense is going to stay on the field now for this fourth and seven. The Lions come to the line of scrimmage and empty out the backfield. Everyone split out wide. Oh, kicks. Get him. Big first down by the offense that time here. Oh, clock's still running. Damn it. Damn it. Get that first down. It just gives you confidence. It opens up the playbook, and it just gives you a better chance of going down the field and getting the score. Could have had a big stop there. They're back at the line after that catch for a first down. The Lions with an empty backfield look here. Drop back, shotgun formation. The defense gets the sack. No, 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 no. Sack lunch sandwich on that one. There's nothing you can do as a quarterback, but try to protect yourself because you're going down. This will be second down. Defense filling up the box here with a 4-6 formation. They'll hike it to him out of the shotgun. Sticks to his hands. And this will end up as a two-yard loss. When you get the situation... We'll like take this, that. We'll take that. In the second half, it's third and long. You're losing a close game. It's up to you to make... Like to see this blitz coming through a little better. If it's not there, throw it short or throw it away. Third down here. Offense trying to pick up the first. Time is running out. The defense knows it's playing with the lead, but doing whatever it can to just try to run out the clock. And that Ooh. was Mays who got a hand on it that time. Uh, 26. Should have been picking that. It was like a nice little lob right to him. See what my opponent's going to do here. I'm going to guess that he's going to go for it again. They bring back out the offense to go for it. These guys need to make something happen on offense. But time oh, is to run out. Long ball to Deshaun Jackson. Oh, man. Yeah, I am. Mm, I was on the wrong user that freaking play. One play, I'm on the wrong user. Oh, my God. But you pick up a first down. Oh, my gosh. That opens up many more possibilities 
what you can do on the offensive side. Good job by the offense. All right, come on, 99 Pat Pete. I need you to make a play here. Oh, right there. Right there. That's interesting as you watch the receiver trying to make that catch. He knew the defender was close, so he didn't put all of his heart into it. The defender made a nice hit and knocks the football out to the ground. We're drawing near a close, and the defense is trying to preserve a victory. Midway through the fourth quarter. Oh, Pat Pete getting beat on the man coverage. They tie this game up. Now we'll see if the defense can take advantage of the and keep it on their side. The Lions lining up for the point after. It's good. We got two minutes, three timeouts. Game is totally in our hands at this point. We almost had him on two stops there on defense. Stuck on the wrong user on one. Barely missed stopping him on fourth down on the other one. Oh, oh, I thought maybe I could get a spin move off there. And he throws it there and gets another completion. Could be nice and chilly on this drive. Plenty of time. Field goal wins this game. And there's Walker. Brought down after a gain of six. Timeout won't be used here. They'll go to the hurry. The Browns from the 37. Has the reception all alone. The offense is set at the line for the first down after that completion. Time for the hurry up offense. So this looks like man now with press. And he takes off. Oh, I wanted to hit RB on that really bad for a quarterback and have the pocket collapse and that time they collapse on his left side there's nothing he can do and he goes should have thrown it away side. should have thrown that away should have thrown that away all right we pretty much were in field goal range gotta get some yards now tie game in this one fourth quarter is winding down Oh, that was... Oh, no, that was really bad. What the fuck? Oh, Marby. Oh, my God. I should have had this game. So many times I should have had this game. All right, Pat Pete, we need you here. Whew. Come on, Poe. Here we go, defense. Here we go. Big set here for the defense. Lining up in the 4-6. He'll take the snap from the gun. Catch made. Fumble. A big time tackle that keeps them three yards short. Of oh, the my God. Yeah, Tiger, this game's rough, man. I should have had this game. Oh, I should have had this game. And now they'll try over again on second down. The Lions are at the line of scrimmage with a spread formation. They'll send it back to the quarterback out of the gun. Has his target. Oh, come on. And Fucking tackle. Down after picking up the first. You know, when you throw the football like that down the field, you pick up a first down. Now you can do anything you want on the offensive side, and you got that defense guessing. First down here after the completion. 
The Lions lined up. Everybody split out wide. Out of the gun. Oh, man. Fucking shit. The Browns defense will stop the clock here with under two to go as they want to preserve the clock. The Lions head to the line. They've got one timeout left in the game. That was a big gainer. Now it's time to back it up. From the gun. Oh, fuck me. I should have hocked that better. Now we're pretty much out of this. I was, I think that was my last chance there. There's a lot they can do here. Let's see if they come up with something that works. Second down. Sometimes that's how it goes. That's Madden for you. Three real close losses this season, including this one. It's not locking in quite tight enough. Thanks again to everybody for stopping by. The kicker now with a chance to decide this game. Puts it through, and the celebration is on. I'm sure it doesn't get much better than that for a kicker. The game winner at the end. Nah, they live. They That's what they live for, Jim. Yeah, that's what you sit in bed at night and dream about. Kicking the game-winning field goal. Happened here today. What a well, it's 4 a.m. here. It is pretty late. Um, I'm definitely going to go take a smoke break. Oh, man. We came back in this one. Had it tied up. Just blew it in the fourth, man. Blew it in the fourth. Had him on fourth down. Keekster's like right there. He got off the tackle and got the first down. That one was rough. Another one where we, we got stuck user in the wrong guy. We were trying to get our setups in. And I have I mean I have three deep zones. I don't know what they're doing though. ET three decides to not play for that ball message from him quick there he said great game I told him good game that his hook before halftime was BS though ah uh, cause it was cause it was this is my favorite play of the game though for those of you who weren't here to catch it Whoop. That was awesome. That game sucked. 
interception I threw at the end was, yeah, it was a bad throw by me, but the pick that actually happened was like a deflected, uh, bah, bah. Get relegated. We're stuck in this all pro second. Uh, I started out three and one. Thought this was going to be the season. Ten seasons in, we're sitting at 67 and 38. Go show the squad for you guys quick that wanted to check it out. Again, Ebert42 here, rocking the 95 overall team, no money spent. Handing out those tips on how to make the coins without spending your hard-earned dollars so you can improve those squads. Pretty happy with offense. Otto's been playing well. Had Lynch for quite a while now. Looking at upgrading this load Holt. Maybe this BD. Um, on defense... We just added this 99 Pat Pete. Just did this Poe. Pretty happy we got this Kevin Williams. We're trying Poe out for him now. Uh, we're still not not sure. Let's just play wreck that. 82, you know. Like when my D tackles know when to go after the quarterback or the halfback or when to read the screens. It's hard to get that done. You see my Allen's got a 93, I believe, 92 play rack. I've seen Poe played outside. Be a pretty, pretty wicked end setter. Yeah, we're looking at making some moves with our cornerbacks now. Uh, I want to sell Bailey, Davis, and the 90 overall Peterson. Uh, with the coins we get from that, we should be able to pick up a 97 D Hall, who's going to go into cornerback two. We slide and Sherman into that cornerback three spot. We'll just pick up somebody budget for cornerback four. Uh, a lot of the backups are rising stars, so can't really give them any, sell them for any coins. We could sell the. Uh, McFadden, but I do like subbing him in occasionally. I'm going to go see what the price is at on that Poe on the auction house. Uh, Blue Tiger, if you want to go check out my YouTube page, it's Ebert42. I got a, a playlist there with all of my coin making tips from the last month and a half. Suggest going and checking that out. A lot of good stuff in there for you. Uh, earlier tonight, I talked about how both of the sets that I did earlier today, the Combine Warrior set and the 99 Pat Pete set, I would be able to flip for profits if I wanted to. Um, so you can look into some of that stuff as well. Gold badges are really low right now. Pick some of those up for under 5K. Just hold on to them. They'll be more expensive soon here. Down to 89. These will both be gone. He'll be at 94. Oh, we might play one more game with them. We'll probably shove them on the auction house for 94 then. That would be nice to sell him at 100, but I don't think he's going that. Yeah, Tiger, I don't lab a whole lot. Uh, it takes time to make those coins, you know. Get that squad better. Um, big shout out to everybody watching me live on YouTube. Again, if you're catching me on Twitch, make sure you go check me out on YouTube. I'm doing a 10K giveaway for my YouTube subscribers. Just go check out my last YouTube video, the Sunday Night Mutt 5 video. Um, like that video. Make a comment that says 10K giveaway. And... Make sure you hit the sub button. Next Sunday, I will be going through and putting everybody into a uh, pool and doing a drawing for that. Again, that'll be on the Xbox One. You can just post whatever you want, a jersey, a uniform, a stadium, something on the auction house for 10K, and I will go and buy that from you. Send, 
send those coins over that way. Uh, the YouTube, the link should be below if you're watching on Twitch. Otherwise, uh, it's just my name's Eber42, so youtube.com slash Eber42. Um, should get you there. Uh, I'm going to go take a quick smoke break here. Not sure uh, what I'm going to do when I get back. Uh, I might I might play some solos. Might do another head-to-head -head game. Um, might head to bed. We'll see how I'm feeling where I'm at. What up, Tuck Mick? Tuck Mitch, thanks for stopping by. You're the guy I just played, aren't you, man? Yeah, that, that pick was crazy mad in luck, dude. I can't believe I gave up that uh that deep hug to you before the before half though. That was insane. I, I had Calvin in as my middle safety and just didn't play that very well. Uh for the new guys, Ebert 42 here, rocking the 95 overall, team no money spent, handing out the tips on how to make the coins without spending the hard-earned dollars. Just finished this 99 Pat Pizza tonight, was trying him out. We're a uh, reminder about the 10K giveaway I'm doing for my YouTube subscribers. Uh, Catch me live every Thursday from 7 to 9 and Sundays from 9 to 11 p.m. Uh, Central Times, uh, twitch.tv slash ebert42. As soon as I can get 25 viewers for one of those, I'll be handing out the 90 overall final edition. Uh, Leon Hall, cornerback, he's going for like 25K. Thanks for the sub on YouTube. Thanks for the follows tonight, guys. Appreciate it. We'll uh we'll be back in like five or ten minutes.
What's up, guys? Thanks for sticking around. Oh, just played a really close game with Tuck313 Mitch. Then he stopped by the stream. Shout out to everybody for stopping by again. Ebert42 here, rocking that. 95 overall, team no money spent, handing out the tips on how to make the coins without spending those hard-earned dollars. Get some hydration. I'll show the squad for you guys quick. I'll go, I'll go show you my head-to-head -head record. Most hated hitman. Rocking six viewers at the 4.15 a.m. stream. Again, everybody catching me on Twitch, make sure you go check out my YouTube page. Doing a 10K giveaway for hitting 10 subscribers on YouTube. Ah, oh, we're sitting at 67 and 38. Ah, oh, man, that looks ugly. It was like 66 and or 60 and 33. I don't know. Uh, struggling a little bit last season. Played a couple close games. Didn't quite go our way. Uh, but yeah, if, if you go check me out on YouTube, uh, go check out my Sunday Night Mutt Volume 5 video. Give it a like. I make a comment that says 10K giveaway. And... Make sure you're subscribed to my channel. that will get you entered in a Xbox One 10K giveaway that I'll be doing a drawing for next Sunday. My Twitter is ebert underscore 42. That should work. You guys, give me a follow there too. Uh, I will be doing a Twitter giveaway at some point in the near future. should be working for you guys. Uh, I actually have to step away for one second quick again. I'll be all right back. Thanks for hanging out for that second there. I'm giving this all pro second string yet another try here. Um, for the new guys, I was rocking the Xbox 360 for most of the season. Uh, upgraded in January, so that's why the record doesn't have too many games on it. Again, Ebert42 here, rocking that 95 overall team, no money spent. As usual, handing out some tips on how to make the coins, playing some head-to-head -head games for you guys. Thanks for coming and checking me out. Big shout out to the viewers we got on Twitch at our 4.20 a.m. stream going on here.
Yeah, most hated Hitman. Uh, I don't do any trading, really. Uh, so... Thanks for the offer. If you notice down below, no trades, no coin games, nothing like that going on in my channel. You said it yourself there. There's too many scammers out there. Uh, good luck shopping your Rogers around, though. Yeah, Blue Tiger is a good dude, man. Um, he's in a lot of the Madden online communities, uh, so... If you guys want to work out a one-for-one -one deal or something, uh, he's he's a good dude. Lock in on our gameplay here. You guys, I'll stick around. Uh, had a nice stream tonight. Go pick up a uh, cornerback between. 10 and 20k elite cornerback and I'll do a giveaway for you guys for hanging out with me tonight big thanks for stopping by I'm rocking the Rams on offense oh that's a big sack no go auto go Auto, auto, no. Ah, uh, rocking the Rams on offense and the Vikings on defense. They face first down. For everybody catching this video on YouTube, make sure you go check out the Sunday Night Mutt Volume 5 video. Follow the instructions there to get yourself entered in a 10K giveaway for hitting 10 subscribers on YouTube. Thank the YouTube subs. And they will show more and more patience with the running game, so the defense, they better dig in here. Again, a big shout out to all of the people catching me live on Twitch right now. Lick my cats, Blue Tiger, most hated hitman. Uh, 3 1 3, just played a game against me. Oh, how, what? Manning, you're supposed to have good accuracy. <laughs> um. See what they do on this third down situation. Don't like pulling this out this early, but we'll do what we can. Now loading up, expecting pass with a dime defense. The Browns now move the chains. What's the old expression? Just move the chains. That's what they did with that throw and catch that time, Jim. It also gives them a chance for three more downs. Let's go now to Danielle Bellini, who has the injury update. Guys, I just spoke with the Browns. Yeah, is that on YouTube? You got all those followers? Look, my cat. They're back at the line after that catch for a first down. The Raiders come out in a dime package. It's a dime look for the defense on this play. That's a gain of 10. Oh, don't do that. Don't do that. Alrighty then. Hopefully we get the W for him pulling his internet cord out of the wall. Deedly do roll that into another one for you guys. It was a pretty short one. I'll do the giveaway after this game.
Sorry, I couldn't show you the defense there, Tuck313 Mitch. Hopefully we'll uh, get to play some defense in this game. Again, Ebert42 rocking that 95 overall. Team, no money spent. Everybody on Twitch, stick around. We'll be doing a cornerback giveaway for you guys. So I can find someone better in that price range for you that y'all would rather have. And if you're watching on YouTube, feel free to catch me on Twitch. I stream every Thursday from 7 to 9 and every Sunday from 9 to 11. Who's his quarterback? Peyton. Peyton. Peyton's pretty good. Got my chat all jacked up now. Oh, shit. First down coming up. Nickel formation for the defense. We're going to take time out. I didn't get a deep call there. Well, it's worth a time out in my book. First down here. Lines up here. Murray. Somebody tackle him. Still in the wrong formation. I'm in four six. Okay. But I know this. When you run the football like that and you pick up decent yards, that's a good thing for the offensive side and a great thing for your football team. Defense with plenty of bodies in the box here on this play. Murray on the screen. Sending the heat. Getting in on that screen. Now, let's talk about the offensive unit. At tight end, a man who posted record numbers his first three years in the league, Rob Gronkowski. Yeah, such a big target. You know, he's an excellent blocker at the line of scrimmage. So that's nice for your run game. And even if he's not open, the quarterback still able to throw him the football. Oh, freaking 99 Pat game. Pete, dude. You did that to me last game, too. Oh, my God. You never know with the talent of these guys nowadays. Little short passes. You think they're hard. Oh, that's so frustrating. They break a tackle. They got so much. Is it that low awareness? Like, do I have to get rid of him? Is he not worth being a 99 on my team? Oh, I so want him to be, though. Steps up and fields it at the two. And the tackle is made right around the 26 yard line. First down, offense readying for the snap. Wide receivers stacked up on this play. Complete to Jeffrey. Troy Polamalu in on the tackle. The offense is set at the line for the first down after that completion. Wide receivers are bunched up. That was bad throw by me. I've been making a lot of those tonight. So now I got him in cover two. Offensive line today will be leaned on to protect their quarterback as well as opening up some running lanes. Failing to complete that one. So second down here. Plenty of defensive backs out on the field for this one. It's Wayne. It's a first down. Nice little run after catch there. Getting past the yard markers, makes the catch, and gets a first down. First down here after the completion. Let's go. Finds Walker, and he's happy. 
tackled at the 34-yard line. Second down coming up. Lynch and a run right up the middle. Tackles made, and that'll move the chains. Oh, big shout out to everybody catch me on Twitch. To just keep running the football, grinding out these first downs, resting their defense. Yeah, Tiger Sherman used to be over there. He didn't make plays like that for me, so. Oof. That second down coming up. The Browns all bunched up here as they get set at the line. He makes the catch. Good yardage picked up on that ball. That's a real oh, Lynch making those plays. Pick up that first down. Making those plays. The offense heads to the line for the seventh play of the drive. Nice and chilly on this one. Shakes off the hit. B -b -b beast mode no turbo on that play no turbo at any point on that play get that back come back out on D here lock up they'll take it at the 20 It's first down as they head to the line. Two tight ends on the field here. Defense comes out in a 4 6 formation. Give me that pick. Give me that pick. Give me that pick. He was looking short, but the pass falls incomplete. For the defensive starters, a very capable pass rusher out of Purdue is Ryan Kerrigan. Yeah, athletic, tough. He can overpower you on the pass rush, and he also is quick enough and nimble enough. Oh, to I gotta make that play. I gotta be in on that one. Make a big hit, and everybody goes ooh and ah. They'll be on the highlight reel. That's why a lot of these players play so fast and play a little out of control. The Packers at the line of scrimmage. Split backfield from the gun. Oh, give me that. Give me that. This is going to be a three and out. He's such a smart linebacker. That's one of the reasons why he was able to knock that pass down that time. Got it, Tiger. Don't worry about it, boy. I got this. He got himself in position, and he made it happen. He's going to try his luck here. And Bush is stopped there. Well, returning punts is a tough job. It's about judgment. That time, that was poor judgment by the return man. Should have just had a fair catch and never tried to return that. They come to the line of scrimmage. First down. The Browns come to the line with a bunch set. He's wide open for the grab. And the tackle is made at the 41. The Browns come to the line and they put their receivers in a bunch formation. Complete to Jeffrey. They're back at the line after that catch for a first down. Wide receivers stacked up on this play. Looking across the middle, secures it with two hands. The offense is set at the line for the first down after that completion. This play is set up by the long gainer. They're going back up top. Throw to the left. Throws it in the end zone. Touchdown. Oh, sorry. I'm quiet, guys. It's late. Only so much brain power to focus on what I'm doing here. Offense is rolling pretty good. Oh, I made a nice stop on D that last drive. Ready to step up and send this one down to the end zone. Well, big shout out to everybody again for stopping by. And the ball will be spotted at the 20. Yeah, by him. 
Hey man, if they're not gonna adjust, take advantage of it, right? It's my theory at least. Oh, that was my guy. He threw that a little quicker than I thought he was going to. Oh, man. Seriously? I thought he was going to throw to one of those other guys. Ran off that route there. I'll tell you what, this defense, they need to start blitzing this quarterback. First down here after the completion. First down following the long play. Manning from the gun. Looking long. In his hands. Complete. Bailey. What? What? Oh my God. Really? Really? I got to join the SWAT. Uh, I thought Bailey was going to get that for sure. The point, the kick is good. Oh, my God. Oh, guys, what do I do? First down here. Yeah, that's not a face catch, but Sean Lynch is in the backfield. And the second quarter is underway. Oh no. Freaking guy. Mm. I had to make better reads here. I mean, I thought it was man, but I thought his other guy was supposed to be on that offense off the field. Man, you got to take advantage of situations like that. Second down here. Quarters formation here for the defense. Plenty of defensive backs out on the field for this one. Lynch is tackled down. Nice run that time. When you run the football like this, over a period of time, it's going to wear that defense out. There's no doubt about it. Nice job by the offensive line. And they bring it down at the 36-yard line. First down here after the run. Quarters formation here for the defense. Plenty of defensive backs out on the field for this one. Reggie Wayne falls in. Reggie. They're back at the line after that catch for a first down. I like this formation a little better. It just gives me a little more versatility. Here's the first snap after the big play. Lynch up the middle. Should just be real chilly with this. What I should do. Plenty of defensive backs out on the field for this one. The Browns from the 32. Here's the handoff to Marshawn Lynch. Tackles made and the first down is picked up. Nice job there. Yeah, we're just gonna get get chilly on this here. Hey, it's kind of fun to watch a team tough enough and patient enough to run the football to get these first downs instead of throwing it all the time. Offense lines up here. Double tight end formation. First down at the 29. And the give. Ooh, got a good block the shut off on that guy there. Play that time by the offense, and now they have set up a little bit better for myself. Half time is coming up, but first we reach the two minute warning. That leads us to second down. From the 32, two minute warning. We only have two timeouts. Lynch is in the backfield. Let's go. Another handoff right back to him. Taken down at the 27. When you run the football like this and you show tough. Try a little something no here. You fake it and try to throw the football down the field. The quarterback's going to have all day to get it done. Let's go. Didn't 
get it. The Browns from the 27 makes the reception and he's going to be tackled. Injury timeout. What? I thought that was second down. I think he gets the ball. Going for it on fourth down. Split backfield here. Let's go. Press the yet. Press the yet. Please, please. Balls it in for the first down. Another first down by the offense. The defense is definitely getting fatigued. And when you get fatigued, you cannot think. So take what he's giving me there. At the line for the first down after that completion. Mounting a Run a little clock here. Grab a drink of water. Big thanks everybody for sticking around this late in the evening. Definitely be doing that. Giveaway for you guys when we get done with this game. This goes for a loss of two. Got to give the defense some credit. On first down, there's so many things the offense can do. They were ready for that play. On 13. Second down, following the run. going to start taking timeouts now. Play after play after play here on this drive. Oh shit. I got lucky. I was gonna scramble and he started coming towards me and right when I threw it he like sat back on the route. He threw it beautifully right on target. Touchdown. Inside of the uprights. Madden giving me one back. We got forty eight seconds left here to play some defense with. are back deep ready to return oh. he'll take it from the four and they're all over him at the 18 yard line da -da 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 -da. the Packers come out for the next possession hey, hey, hey. Down at the 18. They're going to get him here for a sack. Just doing that without any adjustments. Oh, he's max protecting, so my guys are uh, coming in on him. It'll be third down. Defense filling up the box here with a 4-6 formation. Peyton Manning from the shotgun. And he's going to be... Safety? So, just three plays and out for the offense. The Browns... Of course not. Give it to him on the one. And they do. And they are out of timeouts. Wants to give it a go here. This big return's gonna set up his team in excellent field. On the forty-five. Three parts to every football game. Offense, defense, and special teams. What a play for the special teams here. Good punt return. Forty-five. Quarters formation here for the defense. First down at the forty-five. It's Wayne. The quarterbacks and receivers in this NFL now are so good. It's so easy for them to throw and catch and just keep picking up those first downs. First down here after the completion. Why am I not getting this? Backs out on the field for this one. Oh. 
First down at the 31. We'll throw it over the middle. Incomplete. Looking underneath that time. I think we'll just be uh taking three, to be honest with you guys. Make the safe play. 48 yards. Yeah. Lines up well. Is good. It's good. Give him the old squibber. Call that a half up by 10. It's a 27, Tiger. Yeah, I thought it was like the 30. All right. Thanks for the info. And it's the it's the near hash guy that you're supposed to do it to, correct? Have to go watch that video again. Oh, out of no, I tried to audible. There's a flag right there. They have the ball back and the tried to audible. Continuing. That ball again not traveling ten yards, and what are they thinking over there on the sideline? Well, they're thinking this is why everybody hates kickers. Get the ball down there ten yards. My gosh, kick it fifteen yards. We'll still recover it. Just a just a terrible mistake. I'm so confused right now. It's too late to be playing Madden. Hey, can't even find the right plays. Marshawn Lynch is in the backfield. Quarters formation here for the defense. They'll go ground. Troy Polamalu in on the tackle. Got to give a lot of credit to the defense. They were all over the run that time, and they only give up a short gain. Yeah, I'm in that play. For the seven step drop. Here for the defense. Plenty of defensive backs out on the field for this one. The Browns from the 32. And there's Walker. Breaks out of that one. <laughs> there's a spin move for you from Walker. Big shout out to everybody. Oh, and this guy is going to leave the game too. Well, apparently Pat Pete's pretty good. I got three quits so far. Hopefully we get the W for that. Everybody stick around. We'll be doing a giveaway quick for everybody. For hanging out with me on this random late night stream. Again, Ebert42 here. Rocking the 95 overall team. No money spent. Make sure you check out my YouTube page. We're doing a 10K giveaway. Uh, if you watch the Sunday Night Mutt Volume 5, like that video. Make a comment. 10K giveaway. Make sure you're a subscriber. Get entered in the giveaway. We're doing the drawing for that next Sunday. If you are watching on Twit or on YouTube and you wanna catch my Twitch streams live, so you can get involved in some of these give giveaways, I stream every Thursday from seven to nine, every Sunday from nine to set or nine to eleven, so PM time Central, uh, and then randomly uh, at like midnight and later on in the, in the night. Uh, if you follow me on Twitter, my handle is ebert underscore 42, and I tweet out whenever I'm going live on there. So, Tut313 uh, Mitch, Tuck. Um, some of the tips from the 4-6 stuff that I use come out of the winner's kit. Uh, if you know the Madden tips, guys, um, I can't really give those away because that's something that people pay for. Uh, I don't think they'd appreciate me doing that. Um, you you saw my my base plays, um, you know, from what I was calling. I can tell you the cover one play. Um, I can tell you the setup for that. For that, I'm getting some A-gap pressure out of, uh, which is a nice mix on um, the other play I called, which was the, the outside blitzes, you're sending six. Um, I do quarterback contain on almost everything because it helps against the the counter runs. Um, it also gets the tackles a little more out uh, on the pocket. And then I'll blitz that, that hook zone, middle linebacker, out of cover one to get some A-gap pressure. And if you call that other man play, you can get the other pressure. Um, in the Vikings book, you know, I'm calling that fire zone bl blitz play. I can't really tell you the setups for it, though. Um, uh, but you played against me, and if you watch my streams, you might be able to catch on to what they are. Uh, and then 
the one of the quick audibles is cover two invert so once people start abusing the flats which are open against a lot of those plays you can switch into that cover two invert get some of those blues out there for that so there's a tip for that um everybody who wants to get entered in the giveaway um here's what we're going to do i'm going to go on the auction house uh, i'm going to find a player rated 90 or above somewhere between 10 and 20k and i will do a giveaway for them um, so if you want to get entered in that it's on the xbox one so in the chat right now type xbox one and then whatever position you think i should go look for i'll give you guys a couple minutes to get that entered into the um, then what i'll do is i got some dice here i'll roll a die whoever's number comes up i'll go look for that position for you Probably be grab snaking somebody out of this range. All right, most hated hitman. Type in what position that you want with that. already expired ended oh we should have bid on that we could have grabbed that for you guys all right so we got most hated hitman blue tiger tuck 313 mitch get you guys all entered cornerback cornerback right outside linebacker I wonder. Do some quick searching on here. I know there's some. Not quite. Not quite. Give you guys a couple more minutes. I know we had a couple other viewers in here earlier. See if they're still around lurking. Definitely got some wide receivers in this range that we could pick up. Wow, Reggie Wayne. All right, so get out my six-sided die here for you guys. All right, let me give this bad boy a roll. One and two. will be for most hated hitman three and four will be for blue tiger and five and six will be for tuck good game earlier again tuck i still think your law before halftime was bs but six tuck it is xbox one cornerback go see what we can find for you here do you have preferences any player specifically that you want in that 10 to 20k price range uh, looks like there's a Leon Hall, there's Lane, Joseph, McCordy. Pick up this Butler, Breland. See if we can get any snipes on anybody for you. Doesn't really look like anything's expiring anytime soon. Which, uh, it's one of these guys you prefer yeah, I don't think we can sneak any of these guys in not quite
got a little leg going on between the chat and what I'm saying. there now. Uh, I was typing in the chat. You got one of these lanes? on here for you. Put him up on the trade block for two days and 12 hours. You can either send me a message uh, on Xbox One because you already sent me some messages on there. Let me know what you offer for him. Uh, you can offer anything, stadium, jersey, whatever. Just offer me something for him. Uh, and then we'll get that taken care of. Thanks to everybody for stopping by tonight. Really appreciate having you guys all here. It is 5 a.m. I need to go to bed. So again, make sure you check out my YouTube stuff for that 10K giveaway. If you're watching on YouTube, make sure you stop by the stream. We'll be giving away the 90 overall cornerback Leon Hall. Um, when we can get 25 viewers for one of my scheduled shows. Again, those are Thursdays from 7 to 9 p.m. and Sundays from 9 to 11 p.m. Thanks again to everybody for stopping by. Ebert42 here, rocking that 95 overall team no money spent. And a note those tips on how to make those coins. Giving out some giveaways to help you guys improve your squads. Doing some head-to-head -head play, trying to improve our game there as well. So until next time, uh, follow me on Twitter, Ebert underscore 42. So you can get tweets when I'm going live other than my scheduled shows. Uh, if I don't hop on before Thursday, we will see you guys all on Thursday, 7 p.m. Central. Uh, thanks again. Appreciate all the support. Until next time.